Hi, this is Paul from Outer Loop Coaching and OuterloopCoaching.com. I'm back this week to talk about the secret to industry attention for your album, EP, or single release. This is one of those super simple ideas. You see it all the time. People are always doing it, and you're always thinking, they must be doing it for the art. And maybe they are, but they also might be doing it so that they'll be taken seriously just like you want to be taken seriously. Here's the secret. Are you ready? Guests. That's right. Getting somebody who is super famous or at least super credible in your genre to guest on your recordings will get it so that people in the industry will take you seriously right from the start. Now, this is a very simple concept that I talk about all the time at Our Loop Coaching. It's called launching above the line of super credibility. This is a concept that's not mine. It's been put out by this startup guru by the name of Peter Diamandis. And if you're watching on YouTube, down below in the description, I've got a link where Peter himself talks about this concept as it relates to startup businesses. Your band, when you're getting ready to get introduced to the world, is a startup. So it makes sense to apply it to your band. I also talk about this concept in depth and how you can apply it to your bio or EPK right up here in the corner. Click that link. That's a video where I talk about this very concept. Now, if you're listening to this on the Managemental Podcast, obviously, Go to Outer Loop Records right now on YouTube and you can see where I'm pointing to and where I'm pointing to. And if you're watching this on YouTube, you see my fingers going all over the place. Now I'm pointing over to the Managemental Podcast. Go subscribe. You're going to get great information every single week. I talk about it every single week for very good reason. So let's get back to this idea of launching above the line of super credibility. What do I mean by that? What I mean is that when you are introducing yourself to the world, people will already, at first impression, associate you with greatness. And that's what you want, right? So one great way to get associated with greatness right from the beginning is to make sure that one of the first times, if not the first time, that people are introduced to you, you are associated with greatness by having great guests appear on your album, EP, or single, okay? People, including industry in and media. And this fans' audiences are just as guilty of this as anybody, but so is industry and so is media. They will listen to tracks with their favorite artists guesting on it. They already know that what these artists have done is great, and so it's not gonna be a waste of their time to try listening to more. And more, in this instance, is you. That's what's pretty awesome about it. Now also, imagine, just imagine for a second, you're sending an email out to people in the industry to let them know you are alive, let them know that you are great and you want people to read that email, Put in the subject line the person who's guesting on your recording and it will get open. People will listen to it. That's the launching above the line of super credibility in action. Okay, another thing to think about is that if you play it right, you get a good relationship going. Guests can be asked to help promote your release during release week. And this is gonna get more people who are their fans, just audience, to come listen to you and give you a chance. It's an awesome way to get lots of fans very, very quickly. Another thing you need to consider about this is that due to technology and the democratization of the music business economy in general, guests are really cheap. You don't have to fly them across the country. You don't have to put them up for two days in the hotel next to the studio. All you need to do is get them the recordings, the stems, and have them record it where they are. They can use their software to do it. And if they've done this sort of thing before, it's easy. If not, it's not so expensive to buy an hour or so of local studio time in a studio right near them that they're used to working with and have them lay down the vocals, the guitar solo, the whatever, 
on top of your recording right there. Here's another trick. If you don't like what they do, it's okay. Just bury it in the mix. But if it's awesome, and think about the art of this, okay? Take out all of this mumbo jumbo marketing and stupid economy stuff that I know you hate, right? Don't wanna talk about the money. Don't wanna talk about the business. Talk about the art. Having somebody awesome that you admire on one of your recordings is one of those things you will never ever forget and will be one of those things you're gonna have bragging rights about forever and your art just might be better for it. So again, the secret to music industry attention on your album, EP, or single release is guests. So go ahead. Reach out to the management of your favorite artist, somebody you think is going to fit on your recording and get them on it today because the benefits are huge. All right, that's it for me this week. Once again, visit OuterLoopCoaching.com. I'll see you next week at the Outer Loop Records YouTube channel and here on the Managemental Podcast. See ya.